Uh, sugar. Ooh, sugar. That was really. You're halfway home, Max. That was really creepy. <laughs> she repeated the exact same thing I said. You still there? Did you blow up, Max? Still here? Didn't blow up? Not yet. I need to concentrate now. Talk to you later. Did you blow up? <laughs> That's not disconcerting at all. Or is it concerning? I don't know words. Where is this can? Hello? Oh, is it? Look. Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. All right. Good evening, fish fish. Fish fish? They're just fish. Does this mean now? Fish. Nice work. Does this mean now that we have evidence that we broke into the school? <laughs> okay, seriously, why? I need to find the can and duct tape. Don't see anything up there. Warren equals. Genius of my ass. <laughs> okay. There's graffiti over there. There's not a thing. Did I miss something in the back? In the trash? No. <clears throat> Diagram periodic table. Ass biology. Oh, gross. Well, a periodic table. Wish I knew what periodic means. It's uh, periodic. The only way I know what it means is like happens at certain times, like peri happens at certain periods, certain times. Do I need to go in another room to find this freaking can? Hello. I Wait. thought we used some tape in Jefferson's class last week. So I do need to go in Jefferson's class. Or da in Vinci another class. was a boss. Who was he? Exam file? Eh. Only a B minus? Warren has shattered my faith. Of course, I'm barely passing science. Well. Hopefully, we don't blow up. That is not Mr. Jefferson's class. Bully free me. I probably should find those items now. I pressed E to open the door. Too much CSGO. This is like a scene in a horror film. Eh. Could be worse. Saturation. I thought I said something else. Contest pictures. Let's not. Uh, should we look? We're gonna look. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? I'd... What's so special Daniel's about that? a better actually? illustrator than photographer, <laughs> said Max, the art critic. Well, uh, cigarette pack. Victoria's cigarettes. <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Yeah. Not gonna lie, I used to smoke, and both weed and cigarettes, and I'm actually glad I quit both. The tape is mine. Because I did have issues with Only it. Only one more ingredient left. Where do I find a can? There's tape there as well. Uh, 
Would it be in, say, a garbage? You can never escape the lighthouse here. I think you said that last time. Well, let's search in all the garbages, because I don't think the can's in here. Aha! I was right! Okay, I have the can. Uh, let's turn around. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Oh, Kate. Your locker looks so lonely. She said let's show Chloe that uh, Max is the bomb, but let's not blow up, please. I'd appreciate that. Pipe bomb, oh god. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. Are we gonna... Is it gonna blow up more than we anticipated? That was so fucking cool! But is the door damaged? Oh, we are toast! Here comes the whole Arcadia Bay Fire and Police Department! Uh, so what should we do? Now what? Rewind? Rewind? Hey, rewind? Huh? I guess we still do the pipe bomb. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! I guess we didn't have to rewind. Get ready to haul ass. Probably shouldn't be in here. And oh my god. So Damn, I missed something. I better rewind. Missed something? What? I didn't see anything. Unlock. If I can get this bastard open, she can't cheat with a rewind. Oh my god! Oh, this is bullshit! Fuck you, door! I didn't even realize that. Welcome to my domain. She's like, what the fuck? You are magic. I have no clue how the hell you got in there, but you did it, sister. The company I keep. Now, let's find what we want and beat it. My powers only go so far. Man, I can see why the principal locks this room up. Fancy faux art crap. He must want everybody to know he has money. But no taste. How can you trust somebody who has a fucking bronze bird in his office? I'm glad I was expelled. Yes, if only the principal had a Monet or Picasso, you'd still be at Blackwell. Eat me. I'm gonna pill for the papers on this ugly ass desk. Okay, sure. It's ugly, but damn, is it a cozy chair. This is your chance to truly get all deductive and shit, Sherlock. Find us some clues about Rachel, or Kate, or Nathan. Anybody. I'm on the case. What do we have to look at? Lamp, turn on. Ah, let's not turn it on. Just so people don't see us. Oh, please, I just wanted to see if you knew your explosives and to see your incredible artwork. Oh yeah, we got the, the picture. There's quite a few. Ooh, the bird. So cool to stalk the halls when it's dark and quiet, even with so many terrible things happening all around us. It felt like Chloe and I were walking towards the center of a great cosmic mystery. 
something bigger than any of us. But we kind of suck at master spies since we didn't have a key for the principal's office. No worries with my rewind power at hand. And of course, Dr. Warren Graham. He came through with a bitchin' mini bomb made of sodium, what the fuck ever. I probably learned more putting those ingredients together than the entire semester so far. Sorry, Miss Grant, Warren is the star student here. He tries so hard to help, maybe too much. But what's wrong with that these days? I'm so grateful he's on my team. Uh, files. Let's look here. Look at this pile. You're not gonna look through it? Look at this pile. Okay. Tumbleweeds. It says search, not look. Why aren't you searching through it? Weird. Here we go. This asshole has a spotless record. Uh phone five five five. Uh GPA three point seven. I don't know what that is. Brief summary, Nathan Prescott continues his family's historical legacy at Blackwell Academy with a stellar academic record and a variety of extracurricular activities, including work with the Arcadia Bay Homeless Fund. Nathan is also popular with students and faculty. He stands as a proud representation of Blackwell. Like I'm not going to read my own personal file. Looks like she has a lot going on. Max, as she prefers to be called, is considered a quite attentive student with much potential for her photography. Her GPA fluctuates and she has acknowledged she should be doing better. Her teachers back up her quiet intelligence, though some complaints find her too nervous and nosy. Yeah. Uh, some faculty members would like Max to speak up more in class and be more assertive. Others would like her to be less so. But this is a common student suggestion rather than a specific recommendation. 30 day transfer. Uh, Update. Despite some recent confrontations with Blackwell security, Max tried to unsuccessfully stop fellow student Kate Marsh from jumping off the dormitory dormitory roof to her death today. At this time, there is an ongoing police-slash-faculty investigation, but Max's bravery is undisputed. Why is my phone going off? This file is going to be so spotless, I'll projectile vomit. Victoria Chase is the gold standard for Blackwell Academy, a student with a consistently high GPA and extracurricular activities that reflect her career goals in photography. Victoria also receives high marks from faculty for her devotion to the Vortex Club, among other organizations devoted to Blackwell, spirit, and history. I have to make sure Warren doesn't have a criminal background. He's got a four. That's pretty good. Warren is considered an exemplary student and represents a long tradition of excellence in science at Blackwell. He has the gift of curse. Oh, or curse. I thought it was saying of course. He has the gift or curse of gab, depending on the faculty. Some have accused him of playing science pranks, but this is not confirmed by his science teacher, Miss Grant. We hope Warren focuses his academic vision and continues towards his bright future. Only two more files to go. Oh, we we gained a file, I guess. Um, search. Shut up. Rachel doesn't seem so troubled based on all this, but there's not much here about the police investigation. Rachel Amber is the quintessential student representation of Blackwell Academy. She, excel <clears throat> she excels in all of her studies and extracurricular activities, which are numerous. Popular with both students and faculty, she has the de facto qualities of scholarship and leadership that is a hallmark of Blackwell's legacy. Her diverse goals include a career in international law and fashion and modeling. There is no doubt that Rachel will achieve... There's hairs on my mic that's bothering me. That uh, There's no doubt that Rachel will achieve all of her dreams with Blackwell as the fulcrum. Uh, 
This is Lieutenant Chris Rossi. Or wait. Update. Unfortunately, Rachel Amber has stopped attending class for the past month, and she's left no contact with students or faculty for the past month. Her parents are at the pres at the present unaware of her whereabouts, and Black will hopes for her quick return to continue her academic excellence. Uh, just wanted to let you know that Rachel Amber's investigation has officially been closed on our end. We always hope for that one magic clue, but once again, Arcadia Bay covers up another secret. We always keep our eyes and ears open, but that's all we can do from now. Thanks for all your help. Okay. Oh, shit. I didn't read the others. Let's nab this last file, Sherlock. Always wanted to say nab. Man, I don't blame the principal for expelling Chloe. Bad Chloe. 1.7. Uh, expelled. Police reports? Wow. Chloe Price is a problematic student at Blackwell despite the best efforts of the faculty and administration to guide her academically. Chloe does little homework and is often willfully belligerent to her teachers. She has accused numerous class disruptions with... She has caused... New, sorry, numerous class disruptions with inappropriate comments and rude gestures to follow two fellow students. She has recently, she was recently suspended for spray painting graffiti in the parking lot. Even though Chloe is an intelligent student with potential, she chooses to squander it on empty rebellion against a non-mandatory institution. So that's the only one that we missed, I guess. <laughs> I will see